Good morning and welcome back to another video. We're gonna do a little grocery haul this morning. Just got back from Costco and like the regular grocery store too. But before we get into the grocery haul, I just wanna show you what we have done down here in the living room so far. Yesterday I didn't film. I think the last time I filmed was the day we were bringing the couch in, which was like on Sunday. Today's Wednesday. Um, I don't have the living room lights on. Here we go. Here we go. Um, so the rug, the ottoman, I think is coming in like in a couple of weeks, but that'll take up like a good portion of this center area here. But this couch is so freaking comfortable and it's really big. It does not do justice on camera, but the fabric is like really soft. And this is like a good, just like lounging napping couch. It really just does not do justice how big it is. Let me, let me set you guys down. And here, let's see. Like this couch is big in this corner right here. <laughs> I could sit here all day. It's so cozy. Um, I have my Kindle out here because I was actually reading this morning, but um, so yeah, we did that up couch in here, which you guys saw that part. Um, yesterday, Donnie hung, I had a massive headache like all day yesterday. I just like hit a wall and needed a day of rest. So, um, that is what I did, but he hung up the clock and our little arches and then he hung up his elk over here. Um, the TV is going to get mounted like up here. Uh, the mount just got delivered today, but we're using the buffet as like our little entertainment center and then blanket basket my lamp that you guys probably recognize from the last house and then over in the dining room um i just have this bookshelf and my bison oil diffuser chat books you know um but i love this dining room how there's all this space over here I just and it's i love that it's like separate separated you know it's like its own little area that makes sense just comparing to like our last house so there's that the hallway is full of stuff that i'm going to be working on unpacking and organizing today so we're going to do that in this video um same with like <laughs> the top of the stairs we've got stuff and then like in the hallway upstairs there's tons of stuff that needs to be gone through for the kids rooms but we went to costco and like our local grocery store too. So I'm just gonna show you guys everything that we got. Our friends who live like 20 minutes away are coming over and we're gonna make burgers tonight and let the kids play. We haven't seen them since 2019, but we've been friends with them. Well, Donnie has been friends with them, oh my gosh, for like, how long? 17, 18 years. And then I've been friends with them since I met Donnie like 14 years ago. So very good longtime friends and we're so excited that we actually like live really close to them now they're just like we love them so much so anyways let me show you guys this grocery haul and then um i actually need to edit a video <laughs> after i'm done editing i'm gonna start working on unpacking more and that's gonna be in this video so from costco i got a case of alani's they have really good flavors in this pack Cherry Slush, Cosmic Stardust, and the Peach. Um, I got a case of the Celsius last time, so I thought I'd switch it up this time. We got Alani's. And then I got some juice boxes for the kids' lunches. Got some ketchup. This is such a good deal. This Simply Heinz ketchup. There's three of these huge ones. They are 44 ounces each, $9.99 for three of these. We got prime, boys. We got prime. Uh, we got some prime hydration. Every time I show getting prime hydration, like all of us, all five of us drink this. It's not like a daily thing, but this is not an energy drink. The energy drink is, there's an issue with kids drinking the energy drinks because they have 200 milligrams of caffeine in them. That is not this. This is coconut water, vitamins, antioxidants, electrolytes. This is not an energy drink. This is like a Gatorade, like a, a healthier version of a sugary Gatorade. So we got that. Uh, this is grocery store stuff. I'll show you that after. Got a big pack of chips for kids' lunches and then making chili this week. So we always use, nobody eats the Fritos like by themselves. Nobody. <laughs> so we use the Fritos for when I make chili. 
Uh, we got fig bars. We got chewy protein bars. I got these for little treats for the kids, lunches. I got Honeycrisp apples. And then look in here. You can get Built bars at Costco now. You guys know I used to work with Built all of the time. Still love Built bars. Still have a discount code if you order from their website. I think it's Kristen Casper 10. Um, it's like a lifetime, like 10% off every time you order from there. But um, you can get Built bars at Costco now. So keep an eye out for those. Don't mind the dirty dishes in the sink. Those need to get taken care of. Uh, we have some Dave's Killer Bread. Got these little uh, mini beef sticks. Some bananas. I got some treats for myself. These little unreal dark chocolate coconut. They're really good little treats when I got a little sweet tooth. Got our favorite butter from Costco. Uh, we got some Baby Bell cheese for the kids' lunches. Um, we got some eggs. We go through eggs like so freaking fast. Um, we got eggs. I got these to do a little meal prep. I'm going to do broccoli, rice, and then these chicken meatballs, these teriyaki and pineapple chicken meatballs with the sauces that I got from Costco in my last grocery haul. I showed you guys those sauces. Ooh, and then I also got this um, Japanese barbecue sauce from Thrive Market, the gluten-free one. Um, it was cheaper on Thrive than it was at the grocery store. Um, but this, I think this will be good on there. And I also have like the honey pot barbecue and then this chicken sauce. They're so good on like literally everything. <laughs> anyway, so then we got ground beef because we are doing burgers tonight. So I needed some of that because our better beef order is not here yet. It's going to be here like in the next few days. So then we'll be stocked up on our, ground, our favorite ground beef. But for now, we got some organic ground beef from Costco and then some grapes then from the regular grocery store we got hamburger buns for our hamburgers tonight then we got tomatoes for our burgers tonight donnie got some nectarines and then oh God, we use these little paper plates for jasper's food like his wet food and then I got just some regular size paper plates. We like to use these for breakfast for the kids so then we don't have breakfast dishes. We're out of paper plates. We were out of paper plates. That's why there's dirty breakfast dishes. It just, you know, helps, <laughs> helps a little bit. Um, got some more. I don't know if I showed these to you guys, but last week we got these um, Teton Valley Idaho potato chips, the Rocky Mountain salt, and then we also got the barbecue last week I also got the jalapeno but we only got two flavors this time but one of my friends her friend started this company so that's pretty cool local chips and then we have lettuce for our burgers like I said I'm making chili this week so I got everything for that we've got chili beans kidney beans diced tomatoes black beans can of chili that's the secret of the secret to my chili uh, <laughs> diced tomatoes donnie got some little coke minis we got oh i didn't mean to get peanut butter shoot kids are not gonna like that they're gonna have to just deal with it i accidentally got the chocolate chip and the peanut butter ones whoops um we got chocolate little bites we got blueberry little bites i need to get back to baking Again, now that I have my full-size oven. Um, onion for burgers tonight. Red grapes. We got green grapes at Costco. Red grapes at the grocery. Um, look at these. Look at these. I can't eat them, but I can smell them. <laughs> I got these for um, our, since our friends are, that's a hair. Since our friends are coming over tonight, a little treat. And then I also got a big thing watermelon to go with our burgers and then our friends are bringing some other stuff too but uh that is everything so i'm gonna get all this stuff put away donnie got our little mini fridge plugged in the garage so all of our drinks are gonna go out there because we've been putting all of our drinks in the fridge in here and they just take up like so much space with this type of fridge because we have our water up here and then like this whole thing was like drinks and then it doesn't really leave that much space 
so I'm gonna do a little cleaning out in here and put all of our drinks out in the mini fridge and get all of these groceries put away and then I got to get a video edited before I start doing some unpacking. Life was dull until you came. I was breathless when we first met. Couldn't keep my hands away. I was speechless when we first met. Yeah. Okay, so here's the pantry. Got everything organized, extra drinks and stuff down there. Um, so yeah, that's that. And then the fridge. 
I only have a few drinks in here. Johnny put a bunch out in the outside fridge, but got this all organized. Our juice box is down here. So I'm gonna go edit my video now and I'll check in with you guys whenever I start unpacking. Okay, we're back. I got a video edited. It is uploading now. I just sat there and got that done. So, got that taken care of. I just need to make a thumbnail whenever that's done so I can get it live. I put on some comfy clothes and uh, we're gonna get to work unpacking. It is almost two o'clock. Donnie's gonna get the kids from school in a little while and then our friends are coming over at six. So I've got some time and I'm just gonna get to work get as much done as I can because all this stuff that's sitting here in the hallway has just been taunting me for the last few days. But yesterday I just didn't really, I mean, I did stuff. I did laundry, I did stuff, but I didn't like unpack. Um, so I'm gonna try to get as much done today as I can. But the shirt is from our merch shop. All of our t-shirts in our merch shop are on Comfort Colors t-shirts. And if you send if you send a message on Etsy to my shop manager, she can literally put anything on a shirt for you. Like she can do custom orders and everything. So I don't know what is going on with my alfalfa back here. Donnie's talking, well, the front door's open, the back door's open, Donnie's talking to somebody. Anyways, um, merch shop, and then these shorts are from Amazon. They're in my Amazon shop, but I'm gonna get to work. just been kind of playing around with stuff and where we want to hang it so I think we're gonna do this uh, this was in our laundry room and it was also in the boys room at one point at the old house but I think we're gonna do it right here in the dining room and have it be like a little like each kid can have one of the baskets or like a little homework spot or you know papers whatever we need to like organize that needs to be done or whatever um, on this wall here in the dining room and then what else oh this shelf this was in berkeley's room in our old house we're gonna hang it right here by the garage door for like keys and purses and whatnot and then we're gonna hang this right here it's like one of the only signs that i have with words on it i was telling you guys that in one of the recent moving vlogs i gave all of my word signs to one of my friends who wanted to have those in her house and then also i wanted to show you guys this rug i got this rug from amazon it's a washable rug jasper loves it it is so freaking soft my battery died when i was telling you guys about the rug but it's like grippy on the bottom and it's washable and it's very very soft and Jaspie loves it, but I got it for the entryway. It's so it's a five by seven, fits perfect right here. 
Um, I think I want to do, I don't know. I need to figure out the entryway. So that sign is going to go up there. And then I want to do like a little plant or something in the, probably like a faux plant in the corner right here. And then um, I want to keep this all like open because we use the garage like mostly to come in. So we're not using the front door for like, you know, dropping backpacks and stuff like that. Um, so on this huge wall here i'm thinking of doing small wood homes um like big prints of the kids right here possibly i don't know i might take my time on that and just leave this blank for a little while but i have this huge huge wall kind of like our old house but at our old house the big wall had bedroom doors on it so this one's just a giant blank wall that i need to figure out what to do with so now i've got this stuff on the stairs I need to go put in the rooms I need to go in and then we have a whole bunch of work to do upstairs too but before I go upstairs I'm gonna get this dining area picked up and unpack these little few little boxes so that way this area is all cleaned up looking like upstairs in the hallway so I want to get all these boxes unpacked get everything put into the kids rooms at least put into their rooms and then later this week I can like organize everything um, I just want to get this hallway cleared out today because I've had enough of these boxes up here um, so we're gonna do that now upstairs done so that's awesome and I am going to call it a day on filming but thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed doing a little unpacking and organizing with me but um, oh and the grocery haul of course make sure to subscribe if you are new and I'll see you again very soon bye